Next week, Levi is concerned when he hasn't heard from Abby for more than two days. Mackenzie cannot see what the big deal is, until Levi admits that he lent her money to fund her habit. Mac is lost for words as Levi tries to justify his actions, pointing out that she could have got into further trouble if she resorted to stealing money. Frustrated, Mac tells him being caught could have been the wake-up call Abby needed, and later warns him that unless he forces her to get help, Abby will continue to exploit him. Deep down, Levi knows she's right. Meanwhile, Abby wakes up on the sofa of her dealer Dom in the city as she comes down from a big high. She asks Dom if she can stay as she could do with another hit soon, but asks if she can owe him as she's out of cash. Dom assures her they can work something out. Abby assures him that she'll get him the cash ASAP, and that he knows she's good for it, but Dom tells him he's done with that arrangement, there's other ways to pay it at. As Abby looks into the corridor to see a dolled up lady leading a man into one of the bedrooms, Dom tells her that an hour's work and her debt is paid. He's even gone as far as to book Abby in for a session with one of his regulars, who always likes a fresh face. Horrified, Abby locks herself in the bathroom and calls Levi, giving him the address of the house and telling him she's in serious trouble. Levi bumps into Eden as he rushes to his car, who insists on accompanying him after learning that Abby is in danger. Levi fills Eden in on the situation en route, and they're soon knocking on the door of the address Abby gave. When Dom answers, he denies knowing Abby and claims that he's alone in the house, leaving Levi and Eden to believe they must have got the wrong address. As the pair decide to go knocking on other doors, Dom has forced Abby into one of the bedrooms and tells her that Levi has been and gone, ordering her to put on the outfit laid out on the bed for her. Levi and Eden have no luck with the rest of the street, but are curious when they see a girl leaving Dom's house, considering he said he was alone. A quick conversation with the girl soon clarifies exactly what sort of activities are going on inside. Inside they find Abby shaken but otherwise unharmed. Levi pins Dom up against the wall as Eden leads her sister to safety. The two take Abby to the local motel, but know that things aren't over by a long shot. After Abby freshens herself up, she's already shaking from withdrawals. Levi again offers to help her get through this if she's ready, and she finally agrees that she needs help. She still refuses to go to rehab however, if she's going to do this, she wants to go cold turkey. Both Levi and Eden know the risks involved, but both agree to stay and support Abby however bad it gets. 